So I'm just doing my hair right now, putting some coconut oil with a little bit of castor oil on it. It helps me with um, the dryness and uh, I guess the, some of the static during the winter time. I don't do it a lot. I only do it like usually like winter times and um, I do it maybe once, twice a month, just whenever I get a chance. Um, but the reason why I'm taking a video right now is to share my experience and hope uh, people will educate or not, get educated and not fall for the same uh, scam that I fell. I, like, I know, I'm so stupid. Like, um, This is about my Instagram account. As you all know, if you follow me that I lost it, I cannot log into it anymore. So I'm gonna tell you what not to do and how to not get hacked. So what happened was I have this um, friend of mine that I met at one of my photo shoots that attend uh, one of the photo shoots that I attended and uh, we follow each other on Instagram. And then, well, um, what do you call it? Um, I saw another account of hers with her picture, her name, and uh, stuff that um, uh, followed me. So I followed her back because I was just thinking, oh, uh, maybe she created a new account for some reason. Like some people I know, like they have multiple accounts, like one for professional, one for just like whatever nonsense they want to post and stuff like that. And, um, so I followed her back and then I got a message from her later that day saying, um, oh, my account got hacked. Um, and, uh, the whole day the, the hacker has been sending my followers, um, text message like this. She had a screenshot of the text message and, um, she was asking me if I received, uh, some text, text message like that. And I said, no, I haven't, but, um, like, um, what do you call that? I'm gonna let you know when I do. And she said, yeah, uh, she was saying like, copy it. Don't click the link copy it and send it to me so I can report it or something like that. And I was like, okay, like, you know, like how, um, you already know that, you know, when you receive like some kind of weird email from somebody that you don't know, uh, that you don't click any link or call the number that, um, it's telling you to or something. And, um, so I was like, I don't know, like it didn't, uh, at that time there's no, um, kind of red flag that flashed at the back of my mind. And then a few seconds later, I was, or, or maybe a minute later or something, I received that text message that she was talking about. And then I was like, okay, like I copied it and I sent it to her. A second, if I was late, if I didn't send it to her right away, like I was late maybe two seconds, I wouldn't have been scammed because after I sent it to her, she like she messaged me on Instagram saying, "Did you get it?" And I was like, "Oh my gosh, what did I just do?" And I was like, "Are you really who you say you are?" And then I started asking questions. She wouldn't reply and stuff. And um, I don't know. She wouldn't reply. I don't even know like if this is like actual you know female or i don't know maybe it's a horse or something um <laughs> sorry uh what do you call that so yeah but then it was like too late like um i got a i got an email from uh from uh instagram saying like oh somebody logged into your account blah 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 is this you or something so i went there and i was like and i changed my password and stuff and I, I i felt like i was playing like uh I, I was in this kind of race with this hacker changing my stuff and um so long story short i spent like freaking hours doing it and um 
long story short, the, uh, the hacker changed my phone number that's registered in there. And, uh, what it, and then they set up um, uh, two-factor authentication to log in. And um, with that, um, it sends you codes. Like, like, for example, like when I log in, when I log in, um, I can put in like my password and uh, like it would send me like a, like a code, like a, as a text message. And I would enter that code. And then like if you have like a two-factor authentication, it's going to ask you for like uh, another set of codes that was sent to you previously when you set up that um, that uh, two-factor authentication. Thomas, stop it. And then um, they send it to you like um, through that, like I guess, number or email that you registered with that I don't have. So I couldn't log in. And um, I tried everything. Like I tried to do that uh, video thing um, send like this like video clip or whatever of my face looking this way and that way and blah 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 to Instagram but they I don't even think they checked that or whatever because uh, I did it like multiple times and then they said we couldn't verify we couldn't verify blah 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 so I just like you know what and then like uh, I kept receiving emails like that um, people have been logging in into my account from different countries like at first it was just Toronto and then it went to Paris, uh, it went to uh, New York, and I don't know, I have it, like, I just thought, like, I emailed Instagram, like, I replied to their emails to me, saying, like, this is not me, I can't log in, like, help me, blah, 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 and I did, like, I, I did some, like, uh, research, like, Google, and I found, like, some other options to do, like, on Reddit, like, reporting my, um, my account through another person's account or something, I did everything, I didn't get a, I didn't get a, a like any help or any response from Instagram that is like actually helpful. Like I mean, I can't really blame them. It was my fault for not knowing like these things, and um, it got taken advantage of by like some people that I don't even have a clue what they're gonna do with my account. I just hope they don't try to scam my friends, you know. And I already like luckily like when I um when I kind of realized that I might be hacked or something like that, I was still able to post that, you know, hey guys, like I feel like I think my 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 account might be hacked or something. Like, you know, like kind of warning people. And um, I did text like the people that I have number, like I, I, I have num number off to like, you know, like not respond to like that account or something. And I did tell my friends that I'm not going to create another Instagram account. I mean, I feel bad for, for that account being lost. Like, I don't have access to anymore. Um, What do you call that? Like, but, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. And I, I just hope that, you know, people, people won't, like, the, like, whoever these people are that hack my account, like, they don't do anything like stupid with my account or something i can just hope for that and pray you know like, i don't know maybe there, there's nothing really there anyway like it's my photos like what are they gonna do make fake ids with my face or something like i don't know it's so stupid but i think people do that like i don't know but it's i don't know like it's just like it's weird it's there's nothing really there it's my videos and my pictures and um, I don't know, God's words that I share a lot. I don't know, maybe like if they read it, they hopefully find the truth in their lives and stuff. But you know what, whatever, like I, I feel, I feel like a little bit like bad that I lost that account, but it's, it's okay. Like to me, it's fine. Like I actually feel more like... I don't know, less like obliged or, or like of kind of um, pushed into uh, posting every day and stuff like that. I, I feel more like, I, I feel lighter. I feel like more free, like a, a little bit free. Having no Instagram account, I'm fine with that. Uh, I still have my Facebook. 
you know. I have my TikTok. I barely use it, but you know, whatever. I use I I use my Facebook a lot, and usually that's like where I store like most of my pictures. I don't know, ninety nine percent of them, you know. And I I still have my YouTube account and stuff, but but that's it. Like I'm I'm fine. Like most of my friends, most of my friends, my you know, like people that I actually interact with. And at people that I know, like from back home, from when I was younger and stuff, like they're they're on Facebook, so uh, I'm fine. Like I can still communicate with them. Like I have phone numbers for the people that most of the people that you know I actually know on like my Instagram account. So I'm okay. I'm okay. It's not like I'm gonna lose uh, contact with the, with these people or. You know, like I, I can't like see them anymore or something like it's not it's not that of a big deal. It's not the end of the world or something. I just made this video to um, let people know what happened to my account and um, uh, what you call and then hopefully this doesn't happen to you guys. And um, I hope like those people that because uh, I don't know what the purpose was by hacking my account because I'm not famous. I don't make money off of that account. I don't know, like, I don't know, like, whatever. Like, it's not, I'm not gonna die without my Instagram, you know? Like, whatever. Uh, all right, guys, that's about it. I know it's pretty long. I gotta wrap my hair now and um, wait hours before I can wash it. And this is it. I'm going to end my video. It's too long now. 12 minutes over. All right. Thank you for listening and be careful out there. Um, make sure that you don't just trust people. And um, yeah, ask questions. If they are re really your, your friend or your, like, you know, if they really know you, they, they don't, they, they, they're not going to get mad like with you asking them questions because, you, you know, like you're just being safe and do the same thing, you know? All right, see you guys. Bye.